there is a crop that is neglected by most farmers. This crop has got high returns. If planted well, taken care of good management, I tell you, you will be smiling all the way to the bank. This is a crop that gives you oil. And the poor byproduct is sold to those people who keep livestock, making it a double income. I'm talking about the sunflower. Sunflower is grown in Zambia. Hi, I'm the mad farmer from Shipangari district, Karichelo village, Chief Chukwe, deep down in the village of Eastern Province. Welcome to my videos. Like I always say, my videos are based on agriculture, be it animal or plant. Today, I am going to look at the sunflower crop. Remember, I'm not a professional man, but I'm somebody who has a pattern for agriculture because I believe in sharing. Because sharing is caring. Let's look at uh, sunflower. Sunflower is a crop that most people have ignored, but yet it's got very high returns if all taken care of. It's like a wife, a woman in your, in your house. If you take good care of your woman, she's going to give you the delivery, the services you need. You always be looking smart. You always, you will gain weight because she'll be taking good care of you. So it's a sunflower plant. Most people have neglected the sunflower. But believe you me, it gives good returns because the production cost is very, very low. Look around, there are very, very few people who have taken keen interest in this plant. It gives us pure sunflower oil, which is healthy for most of the people. Today, I thought of looking at it critically and getting close to the plant. Sunflower, if you want to do venture into sunflower production, it's very, very cheap. You will need the seed itself, which is about between 8 to 10 kgs for one hectare. Meaning that, how much is sunflower seed? Sunflower seed is between 150, uh, 150 and 250. Okay, M making it one of the cheapest seeds around. That's for one hectare. In this one hectare, your yield should be between 2 tons and 3 tons. Meaning that... 100, uh, 200, I mean 100 bags, supposed to be 100 bags to 200 bags of sunflower. As we speak right now, sunflower is fetching for 4 quacha 15 years. Meaning that if you plant sunflower, you will have more money. If you want, you can actually add value. It's very, very easy to add value to sunflower. Well, that's a topic for another day. Today, Let's look at how to plant sunflower. You need seed. You need land. These are the many two things you will need. Fertilizer, if you have money, you can still add fertilizer. But sometimes, like most farmers grow without it. But if you add fertilizer, meaning that your sunflower will have more oil, you will discover that one kg of sunflower will be giving you one liter. Unlike if you don't use fertilizer, whereby you'll be, you'll be actually getting 1 kg to 500 mils. We're talking about sunflower. With sunflower, the spacing in between stations should be 30 centimeters in between. Between stations, it should be 30 centimeters in between stations. And then per station, you need to be planting two or three seeds per station. In between rows, this should be between 75 to 85 centimeters in rows. In an hectare, I mean in a hectare, it should give you a plant population of not less than 45,000 as plant population. If you take good care of this plant, it will also take good care of you because you will be smiling. People who keep animals like me, you see, you will get cooking oil out of it. And then the sunflower cake, you will be actually making feed out of it, which we can share in these videos to come. Sunflower is a money spin. But most people don't know or know very little about it. It doesn't require a lot of labor. That's why in our local circles here, 
they call it a Nisman scope. Because most people who just plant sunflower and then neglect it, but still, you still get something. Now, what more? Imagine if you took get good care of it, it will give you the maximum yield. You will not be dying cooking oil. Your animals will not be suffering because you have stuffed it or you will be selling the cake. You may ask, where do I actually uh, give, take this sunflower so that I can make cooking oil out of it? It's everywhere. They are like hammer mills for me. You take, you make cooking oil, you get your cake. And then you get your oil. It's very, very simple. Let's try to consider this. When planting sunflower, it shouldn't be very deep because it will not, it's not going to come out. It should just be between three centimeters, uh, between three and four centimeters going deep. In sandy soils, it shouldn't be very much on top, pushed a little bit deeper. The pH is supposed to be between 5.5 and seven i mean 5.8 and seven that's the ph for sunflower sunflower is a good seed if you want to apply fertilizer like what i do if you want to apply fertilizer i do it one to one okay or well, let me say in simple terms i will just use like for one hectare one hectare i'll just put four bags of fertilizer okay i'll put four bags of fertilizer you see I'll just put to, I mean a uh, basal dressing which is D and then I forget the next thing I do is just to weed 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 okay it takes about between 80 and 120 days for sunflower to reach full maturity it's got a lot of benefits plant sunflower you will be smiling one goodness about sunflower is you still got time to plant sunflower you can plant up to January you still get something it doesn't require a lot of water. It can withstand harsh conditions, making it suitable for all the three regions in Zambia. Region 1, Region 2, Region 3. Plant sunflower and you never regret. Like I always say, I'm not a professional man, but I'm somebody who loves agriculture, who has a passion for agriculture. For more information, get in touch with me. 0977. 851196 or 0966987051 0966987051 these numbers are on whatsapp please if i don't pick up your call please send me a whatsapp i will be available so that we can share but remember share this video i've shared this thing for free why can't you do the same as well because that we always say sharing is caring coming to labor you don't need i wouldn't know how much you spend because here labor is very cheap as you can see in the background there it doesn't cost more to me it doesn't cost much because our setup here is not very, very expensive but i know you don't need a lot if you are if you are seeing these videos for the first time please i've got more videos just search for watching this video from sss sponsored farmers just search for my name there or the videos will come or better still go to my youtube channel where there are a lot of videos on my youtube channel just search for mad farmer kapwata mad farmer kapwata all the videos will come and you'll be able to watch remember to share that video thank you so much Bye bye